In this video, we will provide an overview of the community features available with the Accord LMS. These social features can be used as handy tools to communicate and promote conversations among the learners within the Accord LMS. It is almost like having your own Facebook for your website. For this demonstration, we will log in as a learner named Paul. The social bar contains quick links to your message center where you can receive and send messages, view notifications, and view and edit your profile. More about these later. Under the Community tab, you will find more social features in the menu. If we click on Community and then My Journal, we are taken to the user's personal journal page. Here, we can view and post items to our journal. Let's create a new post. We have a variety of options for our posts. We can easily attach videos, images, and files. The privacy option allows us a variety of sharing options. Another valuable social feature is the social groups page. If we click on the community drop-down and then click groups, we will see a list of all of the social groups to which we belong or can join. Groups can be set up for general audiences, custom assigned, or automatically assigned with course enrollment. If we click on a group, then we will be taken to that group's page. Here we see the activity journal for that group. Posts made here will be seen by other members of the group. When we post to this group, we will have all of the same options as when we post to our personal journals, including uploading photos and videos, sharing files, and privacy settings. The members link is a handy way to view and locate other members of this group. Here we can see information about each member by clicking on their name, follow their posts, or add them as friends. Let's add John as a friend. Now a friend request will be pending for John next time he logs into the LMS. Let's log out and log in as John. A number next to the envelope indicates we have a message waiting in our message center. A number next to the exclamation point indicates we have notifications waiting. We can click on either of these icons and we will be taken to the message center. Under notifications, we see that Paul wants to be our friend. We can accept this notification and from now on, Paul's posts will show up in our personal journal. From the message center, we can view and reply to personal messages. We can compose new messages too. If we want to send a new message, we need only type the first few characters of a recipient's name and we will be shown a list of names to choose from. Let's send a new message to Paul. We will type a subject line of New Performance Management Class and we will type a message. Then we will click Send. The Message Center is a great way to communicate with your learners. We can click on the Profile link to view how our profile looks to others. We can edit our profile and add or change information we want others to see, including a biography. We can upload an avatar that will appear next to our username. The Community Exchange feature allows learners to post and answer questions. Learners receive points when using these features. Privileges, such as upvoting and moderating, are awarded when points are accumulated. This is a great way to allow your learners to assist each other. The News Article feature is a great way to communicate with all your learners. News articles can be targeted to all learners or to specific social groups. Notifications of new articles will appear in their social group activity journals or if they subscribe to certain categories. A summary of recent articles can appear on the learner's homepage. The Accord social features are very powerful and a great way to stay connected with and connect your learners. For more information on setting up and using the Accord social features, please see our video tutorials or check our blogs at AccordLMS.com. Thanks for watching.